Shalom. Our verse today is 1 Corinthians chapter 4 verse 6. I have applied these things to myself and Apollos for your benefit, brothers, so that you may learn from us not to go beyond what is written, so that none of us will be inflated with pride in favor of one person over against another. What is Paul referring to in this verse? What has he applied to himself and Apollos? This will be understood if we read chapter 3. In chapter 3 verses 5 to 23, Paul speaks of the role that ministers play and the role that God plays in the salvific story of humanity. According to Paul, ministers are instruments in God's hands. Paul planted and Apollos watered, but it is God who gives growth. For Paul, the one who plants and the one who waters are equal. They are God's co-workers. Importantly, however, all these co-workers are in the service of the people whom Paul describes as God's field and building. The minister's job, therefore, is to build up God's people. Paul's discourse was due to the Corinthians' attachment to one minister or another. They began to brag, I belong to Paul, I belong to Apollos, I belong to Peter. For Paul, this was childish human behavior. Matured Christians, he avows, look beyond the minister and look up to Christ who is Lord. In pointing to himself as an example, therefore, Paul informs the Corinthians of his nothingness compared to Christ. He also expects the Corinthians to acknowledge their nothingness. Their belonging to any minister does not, break, make the, does not bring them salvation and does not make them important. It is their belonging to Christ that makes them important. Paul therefore advises them to not to go beyond what is written. According to the scriptures, it is the Christ of God that brings salvation, not his ministers. So to presume that one belongs to a certain minister or another is a misfortune. Ministers can help you attain salvation but cannot save you. It is Jesus Christ who saves. Do not let your allegiance to a minister derail you from following Christ. Let us pray. Lord, not to us, not to us, but to your name be the glory as we minister to your people. Amen.